Hey guys, it's John from Tennis Companion. Today we're going to do a review and play test of a popular multi-filament tennis string called X1 Biphase from Technofiber. Let's check it out. As I mentioned, the string is made by Technofiber. If you're not familiar with Technofiber, they're a French company that's been in the business for over 35 years. Back in 1980, their first product was tennis string, and they've been evolving and refining their product ever since. Technofiber is also the official tennis strings, rackets, bags, and accessories of the ATP World Tour. All in all, they're a really solid company doing great things for our sport. Next up, let's talk about the specs. X1 Biphase is a multi-filament tennis string. If that doesn't ring a bell, multi-filament strings are part of the synthetic family of tennis strings and are produced by weaving together thousands of tiny microfibers. X1 comes in two colors, natural white and red, which is pretty cool. It's also offered in three different gauges, 16, 17, and 18, or 1.3, 1.24, and 1.18 millimeters thick. A single set is 40 feet in length, while a reel is about 660 feet. That's going to be about enough to get you 16 or so rackets strong, depending on the head size. When it comes to Technofiber's X1 biphase, there are three key features you should be aware of. First, you have PU400. X1 biphase is infused with a proprietary polyurethane that delivers 400% greater elasticity, therefore increasing the power potential of the string, or reducing vibrations and increasing the overall comfort or impact to your arm with a natural gut-like feel. Next up is the composition, 50% elastyl and 50% H2C fiber. X1 biphase is constructed from thousands of tiny individual fibers with a makeup of 50% elastyl and 50% high heat capacity H2C. Elastyl is Technofiber's trademark nylon, which are incredibly soft fibers that deliver 12% more power than standard nylon strings, while H2C fibers are manufactured and bonded using a high temperature pre-stretching step that is intended to provide superior tension maintenance. Last but not least, you have the biphase process. Technofiber's patented two-phase process is used to produce the string, which is intended to increase the durability and life of X1 biphase by 20%. All in all, this string packs a technological punch. Let's jump into the play test. We'll start by talking about power. If there's one thing that's going to surprise you about X1 biphase, it's the string's raw power, a feature that made it super fun to play with. Generating extra pace when hitting felt automatic, and I never felt like I had to force the ball over the net. Where I really enjoyed the power was on my serve, where I was able to crank it up and the ball would just jump right off the strings. Next up, let's talk control and spin. As I was getting comfortable with X1 biphase, one of the challenges that I did find with my ground strokes was that the string didn't have the grip that I'm used to with some of the hybrid string setups that I'll use. As a result, I found a few extra ground strokes sailing a bit long, so I had to adjust and focus on generating more topspin to help keep the ball in play. After about an hour or so of hitting, and once the string started to settle in a bit, I'd say it really wasn't much of an issue. However, players that hit with a lot of topspin and expect that extra bite from their strings might want to string X1 biphase as part of a hybrid string setup. When it comes to touch and feel, X1 biphase was an incredibly comfortable string to play with, and I found it to be highly responsive, which might be a little counterintuitive with the high power the string offers. Not surprisingly, the great touch with the string was most apparent at the net hitting volleys, where I felt like I had plenty of control and could easily direct the ball wherever I wanted. From a tension stability standpoint, I felt like X1 biphase did a terrific job at holding its tension which would have been aided by the pre-stretching step that I did before stringing. The settling that occurs after 30 or so minutes of play and is extremely common with many string sets was negligible, and I found the strings continue to hold their tension well over the course of my roughly 8-hour play test. When it came to string movement, I was a bit surprised. I expected the strings to move much more than they did. After about 15 minutes of play, the strings had barely even budged. This was of course helped by the higher 60-pound string tension that I used, but typically, I find my forehand is good for pushing strings all over the place. And even after a full hour of play, there was very little movement compared to other multifilaments I've played with. All in all, Technofiber's X1 biphase delivers on power, comfort, and feel, which many players will find as a great alternative to natural gut. If you enjoyed this video and you're watching on YouTube, it'd be great if you could like it. You can also subscribe to our channel to get the latest videos from Tennis Companion. See you next time.